Hey there, Google. It's Gord. Um, good morning. It's Wednesday. This is a, <clears throat> a mix of a wake and bake and a talk on Remembrance Day. My voice is almost gone. Uh, and yeah, I'm uh, I'm really down, but I'm trying to keep this channel alive. Um, again, look at yesterday's video and if you can contribute to my GoFundMe. But today's a, a vacation day. I can do nothing. I can't talk to the banks or anything so at least today I should just look after myself. Um, and that's one thing I didn't do yesterday because mostly because I'm broke and I want what I have left here to last me as long as possible. Uh, so I am only medicating when I'm in severe need, severe need, and right now I am. I woke up today, the, the nasal passages are clearing, which is really, really nice from this cold, but when the cold moves from here down to here, maybe a little more manageable, but a little more painful. I've got a little bit, and I'm taking little bits because I don't want to cough, of Ghost Train Haze. It's a, it's a sativa. It'll wake me up and give me a bit of energy to make it through today. Cheers. Very nice tasting. Dab. Now, today, my friends, is Remembrance Day. It's a day where everybody says, let's remember those who died for us, fighting wars to protect our countries. And I am not one of those. I try to spend today with as many people as I can telling them to remember the horrid of war. We shouldn't be... This is only my opinion. Please don't attack me for it. But to me, I, I lost some, some people in my family in World War II. I haven't lost anybody since. And my grandfather was a chef. Uh, a cookie but I don't believe in war I will never fight for my country I will only fight for my family see I have pride in my family because I raised them I molded them I shaped them they are themselves but they're a piece of me I'm not proud of my country um, I don't believe in pride of country, and I won't fight for my country. Yes, if somebody were trying to take my country away, that I, my land away, that I'd fight for. But a country is just a word. These people who say I'm proud to be Canadian, well, I'm sorry, but you're proud to have been born here? Are you proud to have a foot or a hand? Those are things that just happened. You don't take pride in things that just happen. And then maybe you could have a little pride in our government. Maybe our government's going to start pulling back from war. I heard that Trudeau is pulling the air support out of uh, Syria. I totally agree with that. We didn't have much there. We were token anyway. Let's get out of there. We're not fighters, we're police, we're peacekeepers. But again, a country is only a construct made to imprison its people in many, many different ways, all the way from a prison to just the belief that you have to send your children to die for a construct. So I'm going to have one more of that ghost train haze because it did kind of wake me. 
Um, and I'm certainly interested if any of you agree with me or disagree with me. Be nice about disagreements. Most of the people who comment are. But um, this isn't a time to fight. It's a time to talk about peace. I posted a thing called World Peace this morning. Cheers again. That one was a little bigger than the first. Still keeping it small so I don't cough. My cough is terrible. I sure don't want to show you it. I've been holding back. The nasals are clearing up. And hopefully tomorrow I can get out there and solve my financial problems. Again, anybody who can contribute, please do. Please help. This is the day where I could build up the pot and need to borrow less tomorrow because I'm scared about borrowing because my credit rating is so low that I was even turned down from one of the will take anybody you know the 29 percent interest people so I don't want to take this loan because I know that I'm going to be in more shape having to pay back a loan <sighs> funny times not funny well, shouldn't keep this going long, but again, I won't say happy Remembrance Day. Make it a melancholy day. Think about those around you and how you can improve world peace, because that's what I think about. Peace.